If an error occurs in DNA replication, well that mutation is then going to be perpetuated in every cell after that. So it's very, very important that there's a mechanism in place to proofread the DNA and the DNA replication process to make sure that errors don't occur. Mutations or errors in DNA replication are very, very rare. And the reason for that is because of the proofreading function of DNA polymerase. So what it's looking for is mismatches in the complementary uh, bases that have been put into place on the, um, on the new strand of DNA. And so that normally occurs around about one every 100,000 to one every 1 million uh, bases. So still not very often. But what happens is that DNA polymerase proofreads the, uh, the bases and the complementary bases that have been put down on the new chain, on the new strand. And if there's an error, it pauses the replication process. And then several of the nucleotides that have already been put down get removed. And at that point, the replication process continues again. So the DNA polymerase proofreading function reduces the error rate to around about 1 in 100 million. Now, the, we don't have the same high quality proofreading mechanisms with mRNA because with mRNA, it just is involved in making the one protein. It's not going to be perpetuated in every new cell after that.